he told me, I'm going to kill you. I was depressed, I was paranoid, I lived in fear, I tried to get out. And she wrote, quote, for years, he was my monster. She describes having a nervous breakdown on the set and crying uncontrollably. She said his wrath rained down when she refused to let him massage her and that he even threatened to kill her. And I felt that I was a coward. Actress Selma Hayek has now added her voice to the growing list of accusers. This is a strange sensation and this is maybe the wrong feeling to have, but I want to be honest. I see this woman coming with this kind of leopard bikini. And that was Salma Hayek. When I started out, they told me, go back to your country. They said, there are no parts for Latinas here. What do you want to play, the maid? You'll never get a leading role for a Latina. And this is what truly inspired me. Some people have the chemistry and they don't get along. But on screen, it looks great. There are so many historical cases like is that. Is that our case? It's not our case, though. <laughs> The first time I read the review, Salma Hayek bombshell, I started crying because I thought it meant bomb, that I bombed, that I was terrible in the movie and I was the bomb in the movie. And then I got a lot of these kind of remarks and then I felt like they couldn't see past that. And women are so much more than a symbol of sensuality. I was very, very driven. When everybody said, your crisis is never gonna happen. He signed me to do other movies with him, and I thought, oh my God, because I had really struggled and nobody believed in me. This guy saw my artistic value. told me, I'm going to kill you. I have a lot of personal pleasures that came with the film. Like. The satisfaction of not sitting and complaining about the things I don't get, but getting up and getting them done. Now to the latest on Harvey Weinstein. The New York Times reporting allegations by numerous women who say the Hollywood mogul sexually harassed them. His alleged victims over nearly three decades include stars like Ashley Judd. When it came out, I was ashamed that I didn't speak up. But when we come together and unite with each other, then it's not about pain. It's about evolution. It's about becoming part of something that moves powerfully and that can make the big change happen. Actress Selma Hayek has now added her voice to the growing list of accusers who brought down Harvey Weinstein. In a powerful op-ed to the New York Times, she wrote, quote, for years, he was my monster. Hayek says Weinstein constantly degraded her. She describes having a nervous breakdown on the set, throwing up and crying uncontrollably, and that he even threatened to kill her. Sixty percent of women around the world experience some form of physical or sexual abuse during their life. Stand up to end violence against women now. 
it is important to release the anger. I don't want us to go from victims to angry. I am a short Mexican Arab angry woman, but I know how to channel that angry and transform it so that it doesn't blur my sight and I can see it. We have to trust that if the little things you do every day are morally correct, then change can happen.